Hi, it's Cassandra. Come back with another video. Today, I just wanted to come back and uh, talk more about family and friends. You know, uh, back whenever I was growing up as a child, uh, family and uh, friends were really just pushed, you know, upon us. Uh, we really looked at sitcoms and everything, uh, the Leave it a Beaver and, and the Jeffersons and Good Times and everything like that. Or, you know, uh, even in the black community, we had a, uh, you know, we had family like a structure of a mother and a father, you know, and children being together. And they kind of like overcame things together and they, they you know, through thick and thin, uh, they, they, they stuck together. You know, you had shows uh, like Laverne and Shirley and, and stuff like that who, you know, it was a situation where friends, they stuck together and they, you know, they made it do what it do. But then you, you came uh, up and uh, you really started seeing whereas, uh, you know, you could lose your family or your friends by not doing certain things that uh, somebody wanted you to do. Like, like, it could be very simple. Like, say for instance, uh, God forbid, my mom, you know, she was alive today and everything, and she would not be able to have me come over and sit down and eat a, a Sunday lunch or a Sunday, Sunday dinner with her because she could say, oh, my daughter, uh, she doesn't believe in... Uh, uh, the Washtown Awake magazines, and so uh, she can't, I don't know where she is, uh, she can't come over to my house, she's not welcome, you know, because she don't uh, feel that my religion is true, so I can't uh, be her mother or her sister, uh, or, or, you know, I can't be her brother or anything, I mean, you can really cut ties with somebody because of simple things like that. And so, uh, no, back in those days, you know, you had the, you know, you felt like family and friends was like your fingers. You know, you didn't, you, you don't want to get rid of any of them, none of them. You know, all of them are just so good. And so you wouldn't just part with them. But now it's almost like, you know, any little thing can uh, stop you from uh, loving your family members or your friends. And uh, people like uh, Jehovah's Witnesses, cults like that, really orchestrated it. And they took the lead into uh, changing the dynamics of family. And so... I don't know what's going to ha really happen when they lose that, you know, that grip over you, saying that you're going to lose your family or your friends. What, are, what else are they going to take from you at that point? You know, it would be interesting to know uh, what they take next. Anyway, uh, I hope that uh, everyone's having a great day, and thanks for watching.